Hello there guys and gals, The Welsh Hunter here back with yet another 100% achievement guide and this time we are getting it all in another fun and short game, what the Germans like to call The Office or the French like to call Le Office or lazy English speaking people call The Office Anyway, it's Z Office and it was published and developed by Icon Games, the very same who gave us the very good People's Farm now this will be available from the 27th of August, but you can pre-order it now for a grand huge total of a very small £4.19 slash $4.99. So very much like People's Farm, this has the same premise where we need to complete various tasks with all achievements tied to doing them. And once again, just like the People, there is an achievement for getting all challenges done in one playthrough and one for doing it in under 5 minutes. So guess what? We're gonna do it all! We will do it all! For Asgard! I mean, for achievements! Uh, obviously, we've got to move quickly, so feel free if you want to watch me do a few things, then you pause the video, as the timer does stop when you pause the video, so that's nice, and repeat until the end. We are looking at around 5 minutes or so, obviously, to complete this, and it has a Windows 10 stack too. Double noise! So, with that being said then, let us begin. So, go ahead, hold the A button to start, and obviously you move Paige, our main character, with the left stick. So, as soon as we're able to, we're going to walk directly in front of us, touch this desk, so we can say, Morning Nick, and then go to the left and touch this barrier. Head directly behind you, past Nick's um, office, past this little ramp here, and there's going to be a toolbox on the right-hand side. Press and hold A to take that, and then go all the way back to the barrier on the left-hand side. Wake up, Nick! It's not your day off, buddy! So hold A to repair it, and that'll get us our first achievement. Bang, tidy. Okay, now now we can go up the ramp where Nick was. The achievement should unlock for us there. Nice and tidy. Go to the left and up to the ramp, and then touch Theo. Not inappropriately, just enough. Just touch him, and then hold A on the whiteboard right here to write on it. Go to the left and interact with this aquarium as soon as we're able to do so. Admire them fishies. And then go back down the ramp to the right past Theo. And all the way to the right there's going to be a moldy leg for us to eat. Hey, protein's protein, buddy. you got to get it down here where you can. Something fishy is afoot. <laughs> That's clever. Very funny. So press and hold A to feed the fish and then go behind you over the ramp. And we're going to be speaking to our pal Jessica. So again, just smash the A button to smash through all the dialogue. Smash, smash, smash. And then when we're done speaking to Jessica, pick up this flamingo. Of course, holding the A button there, so we've got the flamingo. Now just walk up. Make sure to write on this whiteboard. And then we're going to be heading up the ramp. And just to the right is where we're going to place the flamingo. Do that. That unlocks us an achievement. Go and write on the whiteboard there on the back as well. And then we can head down the ramp and down this next ramp to the right of us as well. And we're going to speak to Charlie Bob. Now, Charlie seems like that awesome, cool little janitor that everyone knows and loves. And he's got a hell of a mustache as well. Beast. So smash through the dialogue once again here and then go up the ramp. And this time we're going to take another right. This time we're going to our desk right here. So press and hold A to drop the stuff. Not the bad stuff, it's all good stuff. And then go directly behind us again. We're going to now speak to Theo. So, hello Mr. Eyebrow Man. How we do? There we go. So now we can go back across the ramp and speak to Jessica once again. And then when we're done speaking to Jessica, go up a little bit. And then we've got Richard sleeping on the chair. So uh, speak to him very quickly. Richard, short for dick. We can tell why. To the left, we're going to take a creepy head. Luckily, that's a likeness to my head. And then go up the ramp, and then we're going back down. And we're going all the way back down to see Charlie Bob again. Mr. Glorious Mustache Man. So go ahead, speak to him and his creepy ass mannequin. Hmm, that's nice. And then go back up the ramp, and then we are going back to our desk once more. And we're going to check. As soon as we check the desk, Chad appears behind us, our boss. So go and speak to him very quickly. Meet and greet Baldy Man. You old beast. Anyway, go up and then to the left, we're going into the projection room or the conference room. The projector is missing. So, as soon as we can, just head back down to where Charlie is on the right-hand side right here. And the projector is on the right-hand side. It kind of looks like a... Uh -oh, next to the oil drum. So, we're going back up and we need to place it in the uh, conference room where Chad... Chad Sexington is sitting, so place it on the table, and then go ahead and interact with the screen. 
So we're gonna, again, we're going to smash through the dialogue completely and quickly until it explodes because that's obviously Paige's fault. We're going to get fired for something that is obviously Chad Sexington's fault right there. Because he is a Chad. Anyway, as soon as that's done, we can now go back to our desk. So head back down the ramp, go to our desk, and we need to interact with these three times. Take the backpack, take your controller, and take your headphones, and then head directly behind you, past Theo, and going back down the ramp until Jessica's like, hey! Hey, come back! It's not that you're gonna die, you're gonna get your job back. Smash through the dialogue. <coughs> dialogue. Sorry, got a, got a bit of a woman voice on then. And then just head back up the ramp to the conference room where we're gonna speak to Chad Sexton one more time. And that is gonna be the end of the game. Fantastic. Now, I managed to do this in 4 minutes and 6 seconds or so. Oh, no, 4 minutes, 26 seconds. So, literally... I mean, it does say at the bottom right corner there, but I've got my Welsh Hunter sign in the way. So I managed to do that in 4 minutes 26. So as long as you've done the exact same thing i done there, then you should be getting this with no problems. Another very, very good game there by Icon Games. Very enjoyable again. I do enjoy these types of games. So... There we go then, guys and gals. So thank you so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed the game and the guide, don't forget, of course, to like, comment, subscribe, and share with a friend as well if you thought it was useful. Don't forget to check me out on my socials as well, Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, Patreon as well. And speaking of, thank you so, so much to everyone who continues to support the channel, but especially for those on Patreon. You're all legends. Love you all. I'll see you in the next one. Ba 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 big love.